Hi, my name is Javier Loarca from Hondata. Today I'll be showing you how easy it is to install and set up your Hondata traction control. <laughs> Maximum traction occurs when your driven wheels are going 5% faster than your own driven wheels, assuming you have good tires and road condition. Behind me we have an Acura TSX Supercharged already equipped with a Hondata traction control that we'll be using as a reference throughout our video. The TSX being a front wheel drive, the front wheels are the driven wheels and the rears are the undriven wheels. When the fronts are going 5% faster than the rear, your Hondata traction control activates sends a signal to your Hondata engine management, reducing power by either retarding ignition or adding a soft rev limit until your wheel spin is reduced for maximum traction. To wire up your traction control is fairly simple. You have a black connector, plugs into your traction control device. You have a total of 11 wires. You have your black wire for your negative source or your ground source. You have your red wire for your power source. You have your orange wire for your ECU EOD input. And there's four pairs of wires and these are for your ABS sensors. Now there's two methods to wire up the ABS sensors. It all depends on which vehicle you have. There's the inductive sensor and there's the active sensor. And I'll be showing you today how to wire it up both ways. In the TSX, you can see the traction control wires being tapped and soldered into the ABS control unit. First, I'll be showing you how to install if you had an active ABS speed sensor. Let's pretend the blue and brown wire are from a wheel speed sensor on your car. You will need to cut the negative wire, let's use the blue as an example, and using the correct pair of traction control ABS wire inputs, you will need to solder one on each end. Now I'll be showing you how to wire up an inductive ABS wheel speed sensor. Still pretending the blue and brown wire are from the wheel sensor, you will need to splice each wire and solder the correct pair of traction control ABS wire input to each wire. Remember the wires shown were only used as an example to show you what it looks like to have your traction control wired up as an active or inductive ABS sensor. The link below directs you to the help file. There you can figure out if your vehicle needs to be wired up as an active or inductive. You can also find the diagram to pair the correct color wires to your negative and positive vehicle ABS sensor. Once your software is up to date, make sure you plug up your traction control via USB, click on the Windows tab, followed by the traction control tab. Your traction control software will open, which your next step will be to click on the Owners tab make sure you fill in all your contact details once that's been completed you can click on the update owner details tab the last step will be register your traction control with Honda. this is the adjustable target slip the first position is for the most grip fifth position less grip when you have good surface or sticky tires on your software you can program each position for fine tune 